Hello there Aquarius, thank you for stopping by for your weekly video tarot forecast for the week of December 1st through December 2nd. Today I'm using what I think is my dreamer's tarot. The book that comes with it calls it the dream it calls itself the dreamer's journal, so I'm hoping that this is really the dreamer's tarot, although I don't have the box anymore. I don't really remember the name. Ouch. So anyway, um, I do want to make a quick announcement though before we get started. I just want to say congratulations to Vicki out of Houston, Texas. She is the winner of the tarot deck that I had in the giveaway a few weeks ago, the Law of Attraction tarot deck. So let's just get started with your forecast, Aquarius. Monday, Knight of Pentacles reversed. So this just means that you are going to be paying for something for somebody else or you're going to be spending impulsively or you're just going to get some kind of bad news about finances or about money or your material resources on Monday. I think for most of you we're really talking about just spending money on somebody else. We are getting into that season. People are starting to Christmas shop. Some of us who are a little bit more sane than myself are starting on the 1st of December to Christmas shop or earlier. Okay, so Aquarius on Tuesday. The sun in reverse. This just tells me that you're in a situation on Tuesday where you feel like you're limited, where you're kind of locked in on your options about what you can do about certain situations. Somebody else is kind of telling you the parameters in which you can work. And for you, Aquarius, is um, that's kind of limiting because you're used to being free reign and high freedom. And so that's not feeling very good to you on Tuesday. Wednesday for Aquarius. We have the Fool in Reverse. I hate the Fool in Reverse. It's not that it's such a bad card. It's really not that terrible, but I just hate what it symbolizes. So let's just talk about what does this thing symbolize. So when you have the Fool in Reverse, this just means that on Wednesday you have some kind of situation that you know exactly how you should handle this situation and you just know it because you know it because you know it because you know it. The thing is that what you know isn't really logical, so it's not going to stand up to you trying to justify it. It's not going to stand up to you trying to get your friends to help you support it because it's not logical. It's just a knowing, but it's a strong knowing. You recognize it. You feel it. But the thing is, this card is coming up reverse because you're not trusting your own knowing. You're boxing yourself in with the logical, and so you're doing that logical thing because you're worried about whether everybody else is going to understand what you're doing or not. Who cares? I'm just hoping that all of you that see this video, when you feel this energy coming in on Wednesday, this energy of just staying with the logical when you know you should do something that's a little bit crazy feeling, that you'll remember me talking about this and you'll go, wait a second, I do not want to be boxed in by the logical. I want to do the thing that I know that I should do because it's the beginning of a wonderful journey. It seriously is. If you can trust universe that, okay, you gave me this message, now if I follow through with it, you're going to have my back. Oh my gosh. It's amazing how many doors open and how many good things happen once you start doing that. So I hope, hope, hope that some of you Aquariuses will remember that when this energy comes in on Wednesday and you won't be limited by logical. Yuck. Okay, so moving on to Thursday. Six of Swords in Reverse. This is just telling me that you guys, Aquariuses, are doing some kind of lifestyle change on Thursday. Now, lifestyle change could have something to do with living more healthy. So, I've had this card come up for people that are cutting gluten out of their diet. This has also come up for people who are not drinking anymore, people who are not smoking anymore, people who are exercising more. Anything you're doing to help yourself be more healthy and this does include loving yourself and also making your relationships more healthy too. So, I'm going to be nice. I know a certain Aquarius and how that could apply, but I'm going to be nice here. <laughs> All right, so we've got the Emperor showing up in reverse on Friday. And the Emperor in reverse really is talking about... I feel like this is you guys. I don't want to be offensive or anything, but this is kind of you guys. And this is you guys being kind of grumpy on Friday. So Aquarius, for most of you, I see kind of a grumpy Friday. I see you guys being highly demanding, um, very sarcastic, 
the opposite of empowering, what would you call that? I guess disempowering, like you're not saying anything encouraging, you're saying discouraging things to the people around you. Definitely something is on your mind and has you acting like this, but you're um, kind of being a grump. The best thing you can do is just kind of go and is get yourself away from people and breathe a little bit. Get an office door between you and somebody else so that <laughs> so that you don't have to be spilling all this grumpiness all over everywhere else. Just process things for yourself on Friday. Okay, so Saturday, Four of Pentacles. I see you taking some money out of savings and spending it on something. Now, for some of you, this is going to be an unexpected something, but I'm feeling like for the majority of you, this is going to be something that you've been waiting to buy for a while, and you're finally looking at your bank account and going, oh, look at that. I've got the money to do that. Woohoo! Here we go. Okay, so that's your Saturday. Sunday... Three of Cups, this is a get-together with friends. So this can be anything from a phone call or an email from a good friend or a get-together, a literal get-together, you know, coffee, tea, um, lunch, dinner, reception, whatever. But this is a get-together with good friends and some enjoyable times with those friends or friend. Okay, so Aquarius, that is your week. For those of you who would like to schedule a private session with me, please check out my website. It's amista.info, A M I S T A. Dot I -N -F -O. Get to know a little bit more about me there. If you decide I'm the best reader for you, go ahead and get a hold of me. We'll schedule a session for you as quickly as we can. For everybody else, I will see you next week. Everyone have a great week. Peace out.